Our installation demonstrates the versatility of L-Track. We're using an eight foot snowmobile trailer and by removing the ski tie down bars and adding L-Track and wheel chocks, we will have a multi-purpose trailer capable of hauling two dirt bikes. We will be installing six 48 inch long rails and two wheel chocks using approximately 40 bolts, nuts, and washers to secure the track. We have taken off the snowmobile ski tie down bars and will mount the chocks ahead of the ski bar holes so the new L-Track won't interfere with the skis when used to haul snowmobiles. To install the wheel chocks, mark your mounting holes with a sharpie and drill through the deck. We used a one quarter inch drill bit. We recommend installing through the frame rail of the trailer for extra stability, but it's not necessary. Place the fasteners through the track and then through the trailer. Install a flat washer, then a lock nut on the underside of each. Tighten the bolt and repeat the process with the second wheel chalk. To install the chalk, pull the knob up and slide it onto the track. Release the knob and pull the chalk to click it into place. To install the L-Track rails, we measured two and a half inches from the sides and placed our track there, but your installation may vary. Mark through the mounting holes to indicate the spots to drill. Once all the mounting holes are drilled, line up the track and place the fasteners through the track and trailer. Install a flat washer and locking nut on the underside of each. Repeat this process along the length of the track. Remember, the track strength comes from how well it's secured. Continue the same method of installation with each rail. Once completed, the L-Track links provide multiple tie-down points. While this setup is ideal for motorcycles, the wheel chocks can be removed, making it easy to tie down nearly anything you need to haul.